Hello everyone and welcome to our video on our report features. These are reports that will help you run your business in a very powerful way. So after you've logged into your inspection support network, go up to reports. You'll see our reporting section is actually very large, so we won't go through all of the features, but make yourself very comfortable with this section because you'll find many reports that will help run your specific business. Let's start with my company and office statistics. You'll see here this will show you your total number of inspections per year in a nice clean graph, a very helpful tool to see your trends. Next under reports is my reports. My reports is where I would recommend you start learning about how our different features can help you grow your business. So reports and my reports. And over on the left, you'll see the financial reports. Let's click on credit card transactions to start. And let's click on this month and hit show report. And here you will see a breakdown of all your credit card transactions. That way you have something to compare to from your credit card vendor. Also, if we click on inspections by payment type and click this month, we can hit show report and you can see really quickly how many inspections you did that were paid by check, credit card, money order, or cash. One of the other highlights that I find very helpful is inspections. Inspections. And let's click on the icon that says inspections. And we could search by any date to any date, but let's just click on last week and hit show report. And here you will see the date the address, the buyer's agent's information, the client's information, the total fee and the inspection type, and if I scroll down, all of the information is added up for you, so there's your gross dollars for that week. This is a wonderful tool for not having to do double entry into your financial programs. You'll also notice that this shows the inspections by date was from 422 to 428. We could print that out or you could download it to a CSV or a comma separated value file so you could put that information in another program, maybe as an example QuickBooks. A couple other of our reports that you might find very helpful is inspection types. Inspection types will add up all the different kinds of inspection types you did over a specific time. Another powerful place is inspections by scheduler. If you click on inspections by scheduler and let's click on this month and hit show report and you can see the scheduled by. This will show the scheduler because everyone has their own unique login. So if you're using a call center it would show the call center and who scheduled it or if it was scheduled from your website on our online scheduler system it would show ISN. That way you can track who did the scheduling for all of your inspections. Another great report is the recall appliance details. So if I click on recall appliance details and I click on last week and hit show report, it's going to show me each one of my inspections that I sent to recall check and when and what the status is. Moving down to inspectors, let's click on inspectors. Again, we are at reports and my reports and over to inspectors we can click here on inspectors top agents so if we click on inspectors top agents we could find the inspector we wanted to pull we could decide how many we wanted to see let's take 10 and if we went last month we could hit show report we can see quickly that Kimberly Frazier did three inspections with Michael during that period of time you can also pull this same report for agencies and you can do the inspector you could do whether it was a buyer's agent or a seller's agent how many would like to see and that is a wonderful report next let's go down to agents and agencies a report I find to be very powerful is new agents let's click on new agents how many new agents use this inspection company for the first time this month and let's click show report and if we scroll down you'll see that this company had 24 agents use them for the first time and we can also see their name their real estate office and their contact information so that you could have somebody call them and follow up 
and ask how you did. Here you can see all the birthdays that you've put into your system so you can reach out to that agent on their birthday. Another great report is inactive agents. If you click on inactive agents, you'll be able to see here select agents that have not used this from and we could pick the dates that we wanted. We could pick on last year and we could build a report and we would see the agents that have not used this during a period of time. This way if you have agents that have been using you regularly and all of a sudden they haven't used you in two or three months, you have an opportunity to reach out to them and, and find out maybe how you could earn their business back. Next let's go back to reports and let's go to my reports and let's go down to miscellaneous. Here you can see your mass emails so you could track your mass emails that you did for any period of time. This is also a great report for tracking your mass emailing. You can track them individually under our mass email system that is covered on a different video, but it's right here in this section as well. Going back to reports and my reports, there's many custom reports, agent reports, referral reports. Too many to go over on this video, but if you go through them, you'll see that they're very easy to follow along. Last thing I would like to discuss is the inspector payroll report. If you go to inspector payroll report, the inspection support network will show you how many inspections your inspector did for a period of time with their splits, what has been paid and what hasn't been paid. This is a very helpful tool if you're looking to add inspectors or manage a multi-inspector firm. If you spend time looking at this area, I'm sure you're going to find the different reports that support you and your growth and your streamlining of your business. We hope you're enjoying your inspection support network. Have a great day.